excuse me for looking like a hot mess, but it is freaking hot in Philly and I have to turn off my fan and close my door to the air conditioner, obviously for sound reasons, so I look like I'm melting and my hair is just thrown back because I am freaking melting. It's that time, Birch Box versus Ipsy. So let's start with the one I pulled out of the box first was Birch Box, so we'll start with that. And I really like this little geometric uh, Birchy box pattern. I accidentally like kind of cut the box so it ain't the other box that Birch Box comes in. Anyway, let's open. Why is there no tissue paper? Don't fall. Ooh, why is this open? Mine's falling apart, but okay. We got the brow collection by Benefit. I've seen that like basically everyone's gotten this in their birch box, so. Open for your brow wow. So it's the little, um, oh, it's the little Benefit Gimme Brow. It's like a little, little magic wand. When Gold and Livio saw. How teeny that is. It's like so teeny. But I like it. It's a, kind of smells like, Big red bubble gum. Okay. I hope it matches my, it will. My hair's so dark now, so this should match my eyebrows. Just fine. So that's cool. I definitely like that. Sorry that I didn't even like read the card or anything. I'm just kind of like, ghetto. Next is Rose Privé Eau de Parfum. Lotte Saint Parfumaire. Ooh, it has a little spray. Kinda of looks like it's turned perfume, but uh, okay. Well, that smells very mature. Fresh, but very mature. I'd have to like wear it and see how it mixes on my skin to know how I feel about it, but I'm not sure. How much is this normally? It's probably like super expensive. It's a perfume, who am I kidding? But full size, $120, I better Frickin' fall in love with this little thing, cherish it forever. I cannot justify spending $120 on a perfume. Oh my god. What's next? SPF 30 Broad Spectrum, the healthy sunscreen. Oh, this is from La Vanilla. I really like the way La Vanilla stuff smells. Does this smell like La Vanilla? Ooh, it's like really a weird consistency for sunscreen. It doesn't smell like sunscreen and it doesn't smell like La Vanilla, it just smells like a normal like facial cream. Well, this will actually be good because I'm going down the shore tonight to go to the beach tomorrow. So I'll use this on my face because I hate when you put like stuff on your face when you go to La Beach. What is this? Balance Me Skin Saviors Congested Skin Serum. Calms, balances, and smooths. Well, I guess that's useful, right? Like, what are you supposed to do? Like, put this on at night? Oh, it's, it's very smooth. What smells? Mmm. Smells like eucalyptus mint. This Calm Serum fights blemishes, refines pores, and balances skin without drying it out, plus it smells amazing. It does smell pretty good. I will give it that, but it definitely has a nice consistency. That's nice. Last but not least, I got a lip crayon. I love lip crayons. This is from PBJ Smoothie Stick. This is originally $14.95 for full size, which I'm assuming this is a full size. It's called Raisin the Root. This stick boosts soft tint and moisturizes lips with a good for you ingredients. Newt contains sweet almond oil. <sighs> I hate these types of peel packages. I'm just saying. Oh my god. Come off. Come off, baby. I'm just gonna twist it. <sighs> Don't ruin the break. Okay, I'll just leave the rest of the packaging on there for now. So this looks like nudie, like, we're gonna swatch it for the first time, let's see. Oh, it's, it's very sheer. It's pretty, it's, it kind of reminds me of Lumiere by ColourPop. It's coming off a little more pink on camera, but it's a little more lilac. Oh, it smells good. So that'll be like a fun summer throw in my bag type deal. All right, Birchbox, like, Birchbox is usually not my fave, usually Ipsius, but was a little step up from other ones I've had. I know you guys have to stare at my junk over here, but <sighs> this is real life, you know? This is really what my vanity looks like. No, I'm kidding. My vanity usually looks much worse than this. <laughs> Don't believe me, just watch. Hey. What? Probably looking at my address. Don't stop. I just hit my cat when I threw it. Sorry, Tober. Rebel, rebel. 
That's the theme. Misfits, rule breakers, badass babes. The riot starts this June. We're hitting the streets with serious sizzle and signature looks. Coloring outside of the lines is encouraged. Sitting on the sidelines. So this is the makeup bag. It's a. Uh, it's not my like number one style, but it's cute. But it's not my favorite. That traveling was my favorite. <gasps> Yes, Urban Decay Fireball eyeshadow. These are why I signed up for subscription services. Finally, I could drag one more time. Man, oh, it's tiny, but it's so cute. I think it's one of their. Is it peach or is it pink? No, you're not under the influence. This trippy duo tone shade actually changes color before your eyes. That's, oh, it looks peach there. So gross. It's not really showing up pink. It's really kind of cute though. Bye packaging. Come out. No, it almost fell. We almost had a disaster. Ooh. I'm pretty sure that this is in What's the color there. It looks pink and then peach and then pink. Is this in the urban? Is this in the vice four? One very similar called fastball. Right there. Behind the scenes, this is what it looks like. Welcome to my van too. What's this? What's this? What's this? There's magic everywhere. What's this? Cucumber Breeze mask. Bio Republic Cucumber Breeze Soothing Fiber Mask, as well as a Bio Republic Pomegranate Crush. I love pomegranates, but. Face masks. Illuminating, one soothing, and one's illuminating. Ooh, I've gotten a Formula X before in my Ipsy. It was like a winter color, but this is like a much more corally red. Um, color for summer. I met you in the summer. <laughs> I'm like, that coffee's doing something to me, guys. It's doing something. What is this? Hey honey, 24 seven, honey day and night moisturizing cream. A moisturizer. I've gotten a lot of stuff from Hey Honey. Never even heard of it until I started getting subscription boxes. Ooh, it looks thick. It smells medically. Goodbye, Tab. Yeah, I mean, who doesn't need a freaking moisturizer? What's this? Seraphine Botanicals. Happy hibiscus, I think. This is a blush for all skin tones. Happy Hibiscus Seraphine. It's really cute packaging. I like the little um, flowers on. That's cute. Oh, it's very uh, brownie color. It looks much more orange in the monitor, but it's kind of very brown. Almost bronzer esque for someone like myself. It looks way more orange there. It's actually very terracotta brown. So this is definitely something that it's vegan, GMO free, and gluten free. Definitely something interesting to work with, but I don't know if it'll work with my skin. Even though I look like I'm wearing a terracotta blush now, I am not. I don't know. Usually I'm like really gunning for one. I feel like this happened to me last month where I didn't know which one I liked either. I think I'm gonna give it to Ipsy because of the Urban Decay, and I like blushes and. And I got a Formula X nail polish, so that's pretty cool. And then a moisturizer, and I need like a travel moisturizer since I'm going away tonight, which I already told you guys. Let's take a sip of coffee. Mm. Just looking at my kitty over there like a proud mama. <laughs> Hi, October. He's sleeping and does not give a shit about me, that's for sure. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you next month. for the unboxing and verses and bottom of the boxes or whatever the hell we just did. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching guys. Have an awesome night. Bye! Make a dragon wanna retire, man, too high.